let's see one question from differential equation we have to solve this to start karte hain isko sabse pehle to isko acche tarike se likh lete hain to hum likh sakte hain x e power x y plus 2y इसके साथ dy वाई प्लस वाई ई पावर एक्स वाई इसके साथ डी एक्स इक्वल्स टू जी ठीक है इसको अगर रीअरेंज करके लिखना चाहे तो y e पावर एक्स वाई के साथ डी एक्स प्लस एक्स ई पावर एक्स वाई प्लस टू वाई डी वाई इक्वल्स टू जीरो नाउ दिस इज क्लियरली ऑफ द फॉर्म एम डी एक्स प्लस एन डी वाई इक्वल्स टू जीरो सो वी हैव टू चेक वेदर द इक्वेशन ऑफ एग्जैक्ट इक्वेशन सेटिस्फाइज और नॉट वॉट इज द कंडीशन द कंडीशन इज डेल एम बाय del y must be equal to del n by del x if this is equal we can further use the formula for exact differential equation so let's check for this what is your m your m is y e power एक्स वाई नाउ विल डू द पार्शियल डिफ्रेंशिएशन विथ रिस्पेक्ट टू वाई सो डेल एम बाय डेल वाई वट विल दैट बी इक्वल टू ना बिकॉज वी आर डूइंग पार्शियल डेरेवेटिव विथ रिस्पेक्ट टू वाई सो एक्स विल बी ट्रीटेड एज कॉन्स्टेंट सो फर्स्ट ऑफ ऑल विल यूज द प्रोडक्ट रूल सो वाई एज इट इज now differentiation of e power xy because x is constant so derivative of e power xy will be e power xy will go inside derivative of xy x is constant so that will only be x because derivative of e power let's suppose kx is what e power kx multiplied by simply k okay so we did the first part plus e power xy as it is and now the derivative of y with respect to y that is simply 1 okay now coming to n our n is uh, x e power xy plus 2y okay so del n by del x if we calculate so again the product rule here y will be treated as constant so x as it is derivative of e power xy is again e power xy and because y is constant so multiplied by just x okay sorry multiplied by just y b 
because uh, if you see carefully then because uh, in this question if you uh, go like this so constant term is of y so that comes here so y will come here okay plus e power x y as it is and uh, then the derivative of x with respect to x is obviously 1 now because 2y is constant its uh, derivative will be 0 if you look at uh, these two terms carefully xy e power xy plus e power xy so clearly del m by del y is equal to del n by del x okay so because these two terms are equal we can say that the given differential equation is an exact differential equation okay now because it is exact we can directly write the solution as integral m dx plus integral n dy equals to constants now in first integration we will treat y as constant and in second integration we will take only those terms inside integration which have only y okay so if you look at n carefully only this term is there which has only y because this term has x also so if you write m dx so n m is y e power x y dx and in n you will take only 2y terms so 2 outside integration of y dy equals to c now carefully if you integrate y e power x y so y is can be treated as constant because i have already told that in first integration you will treat y as constant so if you treat y as constant y will be outside y will be outside integration of e power x y dx plus 2 integration of y dy equals to c y is constant integration of e power x y again this is same as integration of e power k x with respect to x so what was that e power k x divided by coefficient of x which is k so here it will be e power x y divided by coefficient of x what is that y plus here you will lose the power rule integration of uh, x power n dx what was that it used to be x power n plus 1 divided by n plus 1 so it will be y power 2 divided by 2 so 2y power 2 divided by 2 equals to c so final answer you are getting is e power x y plus y square equals to c okay now again look at the, the question carefully what were the important points first make this equation straight then this is of the form m dx plus n dy check whether del m by del y is equal to del n by del x we check that that came out to be equal so it clarified that the given equation is exact differential equation then the solution was integral m dx plus integral n dy equals to c where in the first integral we treated y as constant and in the second take only those term of n which had only y so only this term because this term has x in it so only we took second term integrated them 
in the first treated y as constant so y came out integration was just like this in second we uh, simply use the x power n uh, formula and we finally got the answer as e power xy plus y square equals to c so i hope you understood this question very very well that's it from my side thanks and have